Hey, what's good, YouTube? It's your main man, Tommy West, back with another episode of my NBA 2K20 My Team Budget Series Hard Cap. It's the Big 6 0, episode 60 of Hard Cap, and we must be online to play my team. I don't know why I'm not online right here. Uh, shit. Anyway, how's everybody doing? You guys good? Hope everyone is staying safe and uh, quarantining yourself where uh, necessary and uh, hope you're not going too crazy sitting at home if you are. Uh, I happen to have a job that is uh, quote unquote essential to the economic infrastructure or some shit like that. So we ain't, we ain't never closing down now for not for no coronavirus and or nothing else we just gotta have to be brave and soldier on through this uh we are cutting back hours i will have one extra day off a week and here we go uh finishing up a game against the milwaukee bucks drazen petrovic at the line Sinking a couple of free throws, giving us a comfortable five point lead. And as the buzzer runs out, they chuck up a shot, and that will give us six tokens. And it will also give us Joe Harris. Uh, this was the New Jersey Nets uh, ch spotlight challenge. Joe Harris is a 99 offense, 85 defense, 6 6 shooting guard. Got a 97 three-point, 95 mid-range, 70 driving dunk, okay ball handling, uh, kind of below average defense, kind of average athleticism. He's a shooter. That's about it. 18 Hall of Fame badges, including all the good uh, shooting badges that you want there. Uh, he does have Hall of Fame range extender and flexible release and clutch shooter and unpluckable he's got 21 goals to go along with it he's got goal quick first step uh, trapper clamps break starter flashy passer so uh, he should be okay now we're gonna pick up some Cavs players to uh, do the uh, Cavs challenges for that Kevin Porter Jr. I heard he is a good one to go after no one had told me that Joe Harris was a good one to go after. I just uh, up and decided that on my own. And uh, I'll show you something about him right here, right now. Look at that. Shooting from the logo late. He knocks it in. That's one thing I can say about this Joe Harris. He's not necessarily a great shooter, but he will hit more ridiculous long-range shots, bad ridiculous long-range shots than anybody. And we get a Lori Markin in for that one. So that was the uh, Chicago Bulls challenge is done. Lori's a 99 offense, 88 defense. He has a 94 three-point shot, a 92 mid-range, a 90 close shot. Uh, 74 post moves. So uh, he's a, a stretch big. He's not going to do a whole lot in the paint, really. Uh, not the best ball handler, not the best defender. Okay, rebounder. Um, okay, uh, kind of okay speed, 18 Hall of Fames, 11 Golds, I'll let you take a look. Uh, he does have Hall of Fame range extender. And all these diamond cards are all, they're all kind of samey, but they're all so good. Uh, which made me think about the diamond cards that I have that I invested a lot of MT in. Uh, taking a look, we got Cam, we got Joe Harris, we got Laurie, and we have uh, Brandon Clark. So yeah, I was thinking about the diamond cards that we have, and I thought about Michael Jeffrey Jordan. Uh, he's still gonna, always going to be the GOAT to me. But I talked about this uh, a while back when we had Pink Diamond Jimmy Butler. We're going to have a log jam at the... Uh, we already have Buddy Heald, who is my starting shooting guard, and we have Brandon Roy, who's off the bench shooting guard, and now we're going to have probably eight 
to 10 new diamond shooting guards when we finish these challenges. So Michael Jordan is worth a little bit at this time. So we are going to sell him as much as it does hurt me inside my heart. Uh, we're playing this game with our head, not with our heart. So we're going to post Jordan in the uh, auction house. But the Spotlight Sim cards are really interesting. We have some some new car new content from 2K, but these are really interesting. These are cards based on games that people played, Spotlight Sim games that people play. So uh, I love DJ Augustine when he played for the uh, Bobcats. So we'll look at picking it up his diamond and trying him out. He's about 11K. And Michael Jordan sold already. He had a diamond contract and a diamond shoe. We bought him with the diamond contract. We put the diamond shoe on him. And I think we paid something like 60k. So we're coming out, at, you know, around about even. We didn't really make a whole lot. We didn't really lose a whole lot. And in this game against Atlanta, see, we are down by six. But I have a secret weapon, and his name is Russell Westbrook. Russ knocking down at three. Russ again knocking down a three tied ball game just like that I keep Russ on my bench and when I need to win a game I bring him out and uh, Hall of Fame difficulty be damned this card is too good and uh, we'll knock down another one as the clock runs down well, he ends up with 40 points and we get another six tokens and who's it gonna be this time oh yeah we were playing the Cavs it is Kevin Porter Jr. just as I discussed another two slash three diamond 99 offense 88 defense uh, let's see 95 mid-range 94 three-point shot 90 driving dunk good ball handling good passing 88 steal 90 perimeter D Sucks at rebounding, great speed, great speed with ball, great acceleration, great lateral quickness. 19 Hall of Fame badges, 28 gold, which is a bit uh, kind of good on the goals. He does have Hall of Fame flexible release, quick first step, range extender, clamps, uh, the golds, uh, giant slayer, downhill, handles for days, dimer, unpluckable. So he should be fun to try out when we get around to it. And uh, all those Cavs players we picked up, they are gone again for about what we paid for them. So just like with the uh, original Spotlight Challenges, pick up cards you need and when you're done, sells them right back. And we do have a locker code to enter. And it is MT Prime. No, MT Pack Dash Monday Dash Prime. MT Dash Pack Dash Monday Dash Prime. And you will get a ball drop and a chance to win one of three Prime packs, I think we have here. Yeah, we got the Kevin Durant pack, the Ben Simmons pack, and the D. Wayne Wade pack. And, uh,. I'm a little late coming out with this video, but new Prime Packs have dropped. Uh, we will talk about them at a later time. But we do get a Dwayne Wade Award Pack, and let's bust it open and see what we get. And you're kidding me. Ha! Look at what we got here, folks. We got a winner. We got a winner. Don't tell me it's Dwayne Wade. Do not tell me. Oh, it's not Dwayne Wade. What is it? Oh, it's Jimmy Buckets! I was just talking about Jimmy Butler. I did love this card, but we did have him before, and we did let him go, and uh, we're going to check and see how much he's going for, and we will probably, honestly, let this one go as well. But uh, we also get a Celtic Statement jersey and a couple of shoes. And the Thank You Kobe pack remains unopened in case anything ever happens to that. But yeah, let's look and see what Jimmy Butler is going for these days. Yes, yeah, fantastic card. 
but uh, the same same scenario with Michael Jordan. We just had too many great players at that position, too many good options at that position. A lot of rewards cards that we can't sell. So at the time I said, <clears throat> well, whichever card is worth the most, we'll just sell him. And it happened to be Jimmy Butler. And at this time he's worth about, looks like about 40, 40K, something like that. Come on, let's just check here. Check the auction house search uh, function. We'll go to maximum buyout of, uh, say, 40. Yeah, 40. Okay, none for 40. Uh, 40, 35. Okay, so. So cheapest one up is 41.5. Well, we will place ours at four hours for, I'm sure the 41.5 is probably sold by now. We'll go, go 44, 44.5. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, we'll put him up for sale. And our Colin Sexton sold, our LeBron James sold, our Kevin Love sold, and our Jimmy Butler sold. So, that free pack was incredible. Best free pack we've opened all year. Uh, first, uh, well, I didn't pull a pink diamond Le series 2 LeBron James on my other account. But that's only the second pink diamond I've pulled all year. So uh, let's take a look at uh, the spotlight challenges, see what we got left. We got the Sixers, we got the Bucks, Celtics, haven't really done any of the West, but we got the Heat, the Hornets, the Knicks, uh, the Magic, uh, the Pacers, and the Pistons, and the Raptors, and I think that's it, oh, and Washington. So we might go after Rui next, uh, we might do the Pacers, or we might do the Pistons. Hell, I might do the uh, the Hornets, actually, just for, uh, just for the culture. But yeah, we are, we are making our way through these things. I know a couple of people have already done it. They've got their uh, James Hardens, and they are, they're out there in the world wreaking havoc with them. <coughs> But like I said, uh, North Carolina is still doing okay. We have some cases of corona, but my job is still kicking. I'm still working close to 40 hours a week, so uh, don't have the time to grind like I want to grind. But I tell you what, since we've sold a couple of cars, let's go ahead and let's pick up our pink diamond token reward card. I toyed with this idea. But yeah, it's going to have to be R.J. Barrett. 27 Hall of Fames, 17 gold, 99 offense, 94 defense. He could play at the 2 or the 3. Look at his stats. They're just incredible. He's got good perimeter D. He's got great speed. He can score from anywhere. Hall of Fame range extender. And yeah, I did think long and hard about Malik Beasley, but uh, he'll be next on our list, I guess we'll say. But there he is, 97 overall, R.J. Barrett coming in to the team. And yet another reason why we didn't need Jimmy Butler, and yet another reason why we get what we can get out of MJ while we can get it. He should have a pink diamond coming out soon enough. Uh... Maybe we'll pick that up, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'll tell you what I do know, aside the fact, I don't know why we're looking at this card again, but uh, I do know after uh, picking up that Jimmy Butler and selling Michael Jordan, we have a quarter of a million MT. So maybe on next episode, we buy a Galaxy Opal. Who's to say? I love you guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you later. Peace.